Hello everybody and welcome back to Luca Plays. If it is your first time here, double welcome to you. Also, I love you. I am Luca and today we are going to take a look at the demo for Loom and the Shifting Void. A game that I've been kind of, I've been excited for for a little bit since um, the developers followed me on Twitter. Um, and it came to light that it was being published by Screenwave. Uh, a company that I have a couple friends that work for, and uh, they also published Eagle Island, also Spooky's, Spooky's House of Jump Scares. Um, so this game looks good, and we're gonna take a look at it. Uh, lesson learned: There's no time. We need to complete your training. Uh, calm down, R16. The rift activity has been the rift activity has been increasing for the last few days. We still don't know what it is, but we do know it's dangerous. Be ready to fight against all odds. Sadly, you're the only one we've got. Oh, wait, sadly? Take that back, you scrap junk! I never said such a thing. Okay, so what's... Ooh! Okay. Okay, we got... We got punches, or... I mean, I guess you could call those punches. Uh, okay. So, I will say right off the bat, very similar... Like, the, the pixel aesthetic is actually very similar to Eagle Island, which is... Strange, considering it's not the same developers at all. Um, it does have a lot more, like, uh, of a bright color palette, which I am super duper into. Love me some bright colors. Like, look at that, look at that fucking purple. That's a good-ass purple. What's that? Oh. What am I collecting? What are these? Like, what are what do these do? What are these? What are these orbs that come out of monsters? Ow! Oh! Wait, how do I? Ow! Fuck! Wait, do those? Oh, those refill my ability to heal. Okay, so I have like an there's like an Estus system going on here. Uh, what was the button for that? That. Okay, wait. Ooh. That seems like a really friggin' dangerous enemy. They don't seem nice. Ooh. So I- okay, so wh one thing I will say. I'm I'm always really annoyed by hit stun before you can really determine what an enemy does. Cuz like I hit that big guy before oh, you're What are you? Oh, girl, would you like me to bind your safety suit? Yeah, sure. It will only cost you 100 void essence. What does that mean? What is What does that mean? I don't know what that means. I did that without even knowing what it meant to do that. Bind my... Bind my suit? Okay. That probably means something. And I don't have a clear explanation as to what it means. I wonder if this demo ends with like a boss. That'd be cool. So I will say... The range on the... On the punch is... Not fantastic. Though I guess you do have like an actual range attack. Which I should probably make more use of than. Oh wait. <gasps> it locks it locks on. Oh. Oh. What recharges my my pew pew? Hitting. Doing damage. Doing damage refills your gun. Does the gun do the same amount of damage as... Uh, punches? So the, the plant guys seemed to... Die in four hits. Well... Eh, I mean... It seems like it does the same amount of damage. Uh, can I get up there? Oh, okay, wait, what? Oh god, okay. I feel like this game will eventually have like a dash. Because it's... 
It could feel a bit quicker. It feels, and it feels like it, it, it could be quicker. Ow. Oh, uh, I have like two different directions that I can go in. Is this like optional or am I going like, am I doing progress or am I doing side stuff? I kind of, I kind of want to go back and do that other path because this feels like this, I, mm, I hate, I hate not knowing when a game is making me do progress and when it's not. Also, what are those, what do those things do? What do these things do? Oh, okay. All right. I don't know what that did. Did enemies stay dead? They must. Okay. Yeah, it seems like enemies stayed super dead. That's fine, I guess. That's not bad. That ain't a bad thing. Is there a duck? No. Okay, what's over here? Is this also a path that seems like progress, or is this... It's hard to say. That also seems like progress. Ow. Fuck. Ow. I want... I want the shinies. Yep. Okay, I... I'm about to fucking die. This game is, like, surprisingly difficult. I was <laughs> surprisingly difficult for a demo, of all things. I feel like... Is this supposed to be, like, a roguelike? I can't... I can't remember. I don't think it is. I think it's, like, a Metro... It's just, like, a Metroidvania sort of deal. Wow, that guy had a lot of health. Okay. Uh-oh. Okay, yeah, that that seems to do the same amount of damage as a as a punch, as a good old as a good old punch. I wonder if that second explosion does damage. Was there another path over here? Let's see. Let's take a peek. Uh, uh, it seems like it, but it seems like I would need like a. A double jump. Which this game also feels like it it needs. And definitely feels like it would have one. Uh beep beep beep. Okay, so I need to make use of the gun more. Or whatever it is. Okay. No. Hey. Could you not? What did that do? Oh! Oh! I don't know why I'm so surprised by that. That's a very typical video game thing. Ow! Ow! Fuck! I am not good at the video game. I'm, I'm actually gonna probably die. What happens if I die? Is there checkpoints? I haven't noticed checkpoints. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we're going to find out. Oh. That's what binding my suit means, I guess. So wait, what's... But what's Void Essence, then? Is that... That's not the... That must be, like, my, like, the, the healing orb goo. Wow, that's a, that's, that sends you far, far, far back. 
Why do I feel like there's something over here? That seems like there should be like a secret wall there or something. Ow. Also here. Oh no, that that makes sense. Uh Whew, okay. Yeah, definitely a lot, a lot tougher than I expected. Do we have to go back and get, like, the other stuff that we... I guess I haven't seen any of the little blue coin things, so we should be good, right? Do we... we don't really need to kill every enemy, either. That's just, that's just a me thing. That's just a my brain thing. Because we should be good to just avoid enemies if we can. Okay. There's no there's no way that second explosion actually does damage, right? I shouldn't say that. Because now it definitely does. Now there's no way that it doesn't. God, these guys have a lot of health. Okay, we are... Almost back. Almost back to where we were. Ah, that just seems like a dying animation explosion. That doesn't seem like an attack explosion. Okay, cool. We're good. Yeah, you just yeah, you just do that. And I'll wait. There we go. Much better position now. Then there's a, there's the ow, fuck. Okay. It is. It would be. Wait, what? It would be generous to call that a jump. That's like a that's like a hop. It's not the most satisfying jump in the world. Okay, yeah, what the hell? Why does she grab the ledge sometimes, but not other times? Jeez, there we go. This game is... Um, I guess, like, very similar to Eagle Island, weirdly, in that a lot more difficult than, than you might... Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, sure. I don't know... I don't know what Void Essence is. Is there a way that we keep track of how much of that we have? I don't know what that means. Ah. Okay, that's definitely not a damage explosion. Alright, that's... Definitely hard progress. I feel like the demo should tutorialize itself slightly more. Then again, it should be noted. It's nice that the game hasn't gone to such lengths to, like, hold my hand here, and it's just kind of left me to figure stuff out. Ah! Ooh. That was scary. Why am I going back this way? This feels like anti-progress. Oh, there's a robot down there. What does the robot do? Huh? Hello, robot. You know I'm here to make sure you fulfill your job, do you? Uh, go on then. We don't have all day. Wait, what about that other path, though? Is this optional? This definitely feels like it might be a side thing. Maybe? I don't know. Ooh. 
No, it's seeming less and less like that now. Oh, wait. I can do an upwards attack. Oh. Wait, hold on. An upwards attack is... Something special to take note of, considering how many games don't do that and how many games annoy me that they don't do that. Ow. Could you not? I wish I could break those. Wow. Hey, now. Oh! That guy literally cannot be hit by... My, my pew pew gun. Okay. Uh, uh. How friggin' long is this demo? I'm really, I'm really surprised that it's still going. Then again, I guess, I guess Eagle Islands was like... Here's just like, randomized dungeons. Have at it. Ow, fuck. Uh, yeah, do heal. Oh, f piss off. I hate these little guys. Those little guys are super annoying. They're very cute, but also very annoying. There's that entire path, like, back up that we just, like, have not been able to explore that I really hope doesn't have anything super cool. Like, the, like the best thing for my, for my brain right now would be if that path is just, like, basically nothing and pointless. But also, that doesn't really make for good game design, does it? <laughs> Okay. Oh, I don't like that. Don't do that. Oof. Yeah, that jump, that jump, need, that, like, ledge grab needs to be loosened up a little bit. Yeah. Who are you? Just traveling. It only costs you 100 void essence. What does that mean? I don't know what that means. Oh, there's a boss. Okay, this is the end of the demo then. Oh, God. Wait, hold. This game seems to be acting as. Wait, what's that do? The game seems to be acting as if I like have a dash. Do I have a? No. I I don't. Like the way that enemy was attacking was very like dash this, like dash through this, you know. In fact, I feel like a dash would feel really satisfying here. Oh, I see. I see very specifically what you want. Ow. I see very specifically what you want, and also I'm very bad. Oh, that's, oh, that slows me down. Oh, this is a really interesting boss. Those totems don't just affect it. Uh. Ooh, I like this. Ooh, I like this. This is very cool. Ow. Ow. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. Ah. Uh. Wait. Wow. Okay. That's very difficult. That is very difficult and or I am very bad. Both. Both is definitely the case. There's no way that both is not the case. Okay. Great. Excellent. Excellent. We are good at the video game. Oh, what? 
Oh, I can shoot directly up as well. Well, not anymore, because I'm out of I'm out of bullet because he won't come down, but uh Hey, could you could you stop it? Oh oh. Thanks. Thanks for stopping it. Okay, what does that what does that do for him? Does that heal him? What does the blue one do? How much fucking health do you have, dude? Like holy hell. Oh cut. Could you not? Whoop. Come back down here. Come back down here this instance, young man. Oh, this instance? This instant. Oh, why you why you perp? Why you perp though? Oh. Whoa. That was really fucking intense. What does that do? Do I get new power? Oh, come on. Okay, well. I guess that was the demo. Um, hey. Go wishlist this on Steam. Uh, it seems very good. And also, it would it would help friends of mine out. Because they're, the company they work for is publishing this. Also, go follow the devs on Twitter. Um, to follow development stuff. It's, it's, it's good. I like this. This is very good. I'm very, I'm very impressed with, with this game. Um, I'm also very impressed that I'm now at a point where people who are making cool indie games follow me on Twitter. So that's very neat. Um, anyway, I will be putting a link. I, I'll, I will also be putting a link down to the game. Um, they misspelled wish list. I will also be putting a link down to the Steam page down in, in the description below. So you can go check this out. Wishlist it. Etc. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, hey, maybe subscribe. If you want me to take more looks at like different little indie games, maybe leave a comment to suggest something. Um, and yeah, that's it for me. I love you all. I hope you all have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or night. And as always, I am no longer here.